हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ दिस चैप्टर नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज सिंपल क्लोज शेप वॉट डू अंडरस्टैंड बाई सिंपल क्लोज शेप लेट मी ड्रॉ सम पिक्चर देन आई विल एक्सप्लेन इट सपोज इफ आई स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हे पॉइंट ए एंड आई ड्रॉ लाइक दिस एंड इट एंड हेयर हेयर और सपोज लाइक दिस इट एंड हेयर सपोज दिस वन इज सी एंड डी or you can see that like this somewhere here so p q here you can see that <clears throat> i have started to draw from point a and it ends at point b these two points are two different points they are not touching each other then these type of figures here also i started the start drawing from point c right now here i have drawn the straight lines here line line in the again line segments and i ends here at point d so you see there is a difference there is a distance between c and d it's not end in the same point here also p and q are far apart so this type of figures are known as what open open figures or open shape okay now <coughs> if i draw like this or like this <coughs> like this or like this i'm <coughs> sorry mm hmm so these type of figures are what closed figure because the starting point and the end point meet each other at, a, at a, any point here suppose we start from here start moving in this direction and see it ends at the same point the beginning point okay so we can say that uh the line ends at the beginning point here also if you see there is no open space the from the from, uh, suppose from here we have started to draw the picture and it ends here itself here in this case also if you start from here to draw the picture like this and see what happen it ends here in this same point in this circle also so this type of figure is known as what a uh, closed figure but if we talk about simple closed shape so in simple closed shape the line should not be intersecting with each other right now in this case it is a simple closed figure but in this case it's not a simple closed we will simply say that it is a closed figure but not simple because here the lines are intersecting with each other like this also <coughs> sorry if i draw like this then it is not a simple closed figure simply a closed figure so for a simple closed figure the lines should intersect with each other now <coughs> in your uh, book now the next topic is what polygon what is polygon <coughs> so you have to see the figure very carefully polygon is uh, is a simple closed figure made up of line segment if i draw like this like this for example this is a simple closed figure if i draw like this this is also a closed figure if i draw like this this is a closed figure like this this is also a closed figure but in these four picture right now i have uh, drawn in the board if you see here here you will see one straight line is there and one curve is there you know here both the lines are curved in this case all the lines are you know all the sides are line segment straight line here also all the straight lines are here in this way you know so polygon polygon means is a simple closed figure made up of line segment not the curved line so this figure is not a polygon this is also not a polygon this will be a polygon this will be a polygon if i draw like this see the two straight line here if i <coughs> give the end with a straight line then it is a polygon but if i put 
principal arc here then it is not a polygon is that clear because it's not a straight line here also if i put another arc here just like capsule no so it is not a polygon it will be not a polygon it will be a closed figure but not a polygon means polygon is a simple closed figure which is made up of line segment and you know for a polygon at least minimum three sides are required to make a polygon okay now types of polygons <coughs> so minimum sides as i told you just now minimum sides for a polygon we require three sides so this will be our what a polygon made of three line segment that is triangle okay this is known as what side you know, this side this one is also side this is also side this is known as what this point is known as a vertex okay this is also what vertex Here also vertex suppose you, if i want to draw a polygon made of five line segment it will look like this or maybe like this it should be five sided figure then it is known as a pentagon what we call it as a pentagon when three side is there we call it as a triangle when four side will be there we call it as a square when you know maybe a rectangle also this is also known as four sided figure you know polygon it has four sides so it is a rectangle rectangle if all sides are equal then it is square and a square is a rectangle also okay all squares are rectangle five side then it is known as what pentagon pentagon if we talk about six side then hexagon <clears throat> suppose let me draw here six sides here is six sides now so it will be hexagon hexagon means side okay if we talk about seven side then is hepta eight side octagon nine side nanogon ten side decagon in this way depending on the number of signs we can you know give the nomenclature we can name the figures so to form a polygon you know polygon what polygon is a simple closed figure made up of line segment not curved line line segment so for a polygon we require minimum three side and there is a triangle okay there are different type of triangle you know <clears throat> now when we talk about four side figure it may be a rectangle maybe a square maybe a parallelogram if it is like this parallelogram if you push the top portion of the rectangle like this it will look like a parallelogram if you push the top portion of the square it will look like this this is known as what rhombus okay and this is trapezium and two sides are parallel but other two pairs are not parallel then it is a trapezium so all these figures are what four sided polygons four sided figures so <coughs> this is known as what rectangle square rom uh, sorry parallelogram rhombus trapezium this is about pentagon five side pentagon six side hexagon in this way we can name it okay now <coughs> in your uh, chapter <coughs> circle is there now <coughs> what is circle circle is circle is also a simple closed figure okay but it's not made up of line segment it's a curve okay this circle now if i want to define a circle how we will define it simply a large number of dots large number of dots which are equidistant from a fixed point means the distance of this dot suppose this is dot a suppose dot a dot a is suppose in this case 6 cm away this is dot b this is also 6 cm away 
this is dot c 6 cm so in this way large number of dots which are equidistant from a fixed point equidistant equal distance there is a large number of dots large number of dots equidistant from a fixed point it forms a circle okay now and this fixed point is known as what center of the circle this is known as what center of the circle these outside this one is known as what circumference this boundary this boundary is known as what circumference okay now the distance of the center to the circumference this one like this this is known as what radius this is known as what radius and if we draw a line circum one point on the circumference to the another point on the circumference like this this is known as what chord c h o r d this is known as what chord remember that okay so <coughs> uh and if we draw a chord through center means if i start sketching the line through center and it touches the another part of the circumference means it is a chord passing through center a b ab is a chord passing through center is known as what diameter so we call it as a what diameter okay this is known as a diameter so how we will construct a circle so we will take a compass you have seen compass in a geometry box the compass we will pay, place one uh, pencil on the other end and tighten it and you know you will place the pin here and in this way you can make a circle like this okay so with the help of compass you can draw the circle okay while doing the exercise i will try to show this thing in the board so i hope you have understood what is a uh, uh, simple closed figure and what are the types of closed figure what is polygon what are the different types of polygon and this is known as what circle